Try it one more time from the pit of your stomach. But read it again, that line. But there was no sword in the hand of David. He slew Goliath, but there was no sword in his hand. Did anybody hear what I'm saying? Yes. So no police could charge him for murder. When siren began to blow, and they arrived, they met Goliath on the floor, dead. And they picked David up, they said, you kill someone. And they search him. No sword. When they look at Goliath's side, there was a seven foot long sword in his pocket. And David had nothing. So police say, you are discharged and acquitted for want of evidence. But there was no sword in the hand of David. Yet he slew Amayeka Mahabos. Brother, sister, you can win without fighting. Somebody say hallelujah. You see, time will come when you will learn that the battle is the Lord's, not by mouth, but by action. The reason many Christians have bruises and wounds is that they fight too much. Come on, come on. All right. I have been in war front for 33 years and 11 months. No bruise. People who are bruised don't dress like this. The reason is this. I win before I fight. I know exactly the day my enemy is going to die and in what hour. So I don't live in anxiety or in anxiousness. I live in strength. Somebody say hallelujah. You can win without fighting. And you can win before you fight. 